Edwards made a whirlwind visit to Australia, we talked briefly about the movie. Anthony, it's a pleasure to meet you. I know you've been very busy since you've been in Australia, rushing here and there. Yeah. But it's a, a great movie you're here to promote, and I absolutely loved it. I loved Hawks. Oh, well, thank you very much. I mean, that's why I'm here, is because I, I love making it, and uh, so it was worth coming down and uh, seeing this wonderful country, but also to help promote a film that, that uh, I care about. I think it's a different film. It's not your typical commercial, you know, Arnold right. Schwarzenegger extravaganza uh, there's I think there's a lot of heart to it and uh, uh, some great comedy and some yes feeling. Um, I think we should explain for the people that it's a movie essentially about two people dying from cancer yeah. so what a weird sort of a subject you yeah. think oh wow you yeah, know it's funny too but then you think about other great films recently of uh, like my life as a dog yes and it's a kid whose mother's dying isn't yes it? and our uh, terms of endearment is you know about it exactly and I think because of that ex ex extremeness of that, um, it, it creates better drama. Yeah. Um, it's not just a, you know, a bedroom farce, it's, uh, it's uh, some people with some real serious problems and from that, I think as an audience you can relate to that and that conflict and that, uh, that tragedy there. The, the script must have really interested you because the first thing you notice about Hawks is the dialogue. It's such fun about such an awfully serious, horrible situation that yeah. these two men are in, that they're dying from cancer. Yeah. But there's so much fun in it, you know? That's the thing, I mean, you end up reading a lot of scripts, and, uh, and it's so rare that you pick up a script that does have that. I mean, Roy Clark is a writer, so that's a talented mm -hmm. writer, and he, you know, created characters that are going through a tragic thing, but yet the comedy of it, I mean, you really are laughing throughout the yeah. picture, I think, and uh, uh, that's rare. I mean, that's in... Um, I could have been happier. Raise your foot and repeat after me. I do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. By these feet called Gerald. By these feet called Gerald. To kick and struggle before I die. Agreed? Agreed. To be a black knight of the sick joke. A notorious, awkward bastard medically. Agreed. To banish self-pity and to buckle on the arms of laughter. Right. And thus is Hawks accoutred. To embark upon a nightly quest to slay all pigeons that would bar our paths to Amsterdam in search of whores of the lewdest countenance. I do so swear. Amsterdam. Five floors of fornication. That's what you wanted, isn't it? Right. Then say I do so swear. Then I do so swear. You know, it is a tearjerk of a movie, but surprisingly a comedy as well. I enjoyed it very much. It's called Hawks, and it's now at the Capri Cinema at Goodwood. And we'll be back with a song from the movie after this break. And responsible for thinking up the story of the movie Hawks, and he's also written the soundtrack.